certain it's always men can love really deeply what well, women are just these shallow gold diggers that only want the top 10 percent of people and 10 percent of guys and it's just not true okay you only have to walk out your door and observe real couples to see that it's not true you know some of these um guys that they seem to get their view from the manosphere like like the world view okay I, I i do think that maybe some of them are very socially um isolated and actually really don't sort of observe many other people and see how the real wor world works um because i see some comments where the guys will say something like unless you have rock hard pecs and are a millionaire there's no chance of uh getting a woman and i think like what are you talking about just go outside. Aver average men get girlfriends, okay? Now, if it's a case that these guys, they're after a woman who looks like a supermodel, well, okay, yeah, she's going to be more fussy, but um, that would mean that you're aiming for the top 10%, okay? Because <laughs> I've, I've said in other videos as well, it's like, they go on about women being too fussy, but some of the red pillars, they come out with lists of things. Like, I mean, if you're going to say, first of all, if you're going to say... A woman's got to be under 25, like, regardless of how old the man is, then straight away, like, you've, like, already lowered it to, like, being only a small percentage of women. And then out of those women, um, you don't want somebody who's overweight. And, you know, as they're always pointing out in the manosphere, a lot of women and men... Well, a lot of women and men are overweight in the West, but they only point it out in women. Okay, so... If every single man wants a really young, really slim, really attractive woman, and she's not meant to have got one tattoo, uh, she's not went, meant to wear hoop earrings, um, or they've all got to be virgins, you know, you know, some of them come out with, like, lists of stuff and then sit there and say that women are too fussy. And this is what I mean when I say that the advice they're getting is, like, really silly, because the advice they're getting is going to keep them single. Like, if these are guys who are having trouble getting one woman and they're coming out with... And they're being told lists of reasons to reject women. They're being told that, you know, women are all bad people. And that we're, and they get this image in their head that women are horrible, mean, nasty people that are just horrible to men when it's not true, okay? So they're putting the fear of God into these guys, making them think that, like, you know, women are terrible people. And if some of these guys are socially anxious anyway, that's going to make them even more socially anxious. Like, if they've got this image in their head of women being just these horrible, nasty people, it's going to make them more scared to approach women. So they do not help in that sense. Um, 